What's up guys, welcome to the channel. If you are new, my name is Sean. I do a lot of Jeep videos and some adventure videos, a lot of speaker videos. So please consider subscribing if you like what you see. Today is an exciting one. Uh, I'm really excited about this. this. is an inexpensive mod that you can do to your mountain bike. I think matte mountain bikes, like matte color mountain bikes look sick. You can see mine's gloss and it looks cool, but matte looks cooler in my opinion. So to fix that, to add matte to it, I got this thing from Amazon. It is called Lamin X Protective Films Frame Guard and it has a matte finish to it. So it's clear, but it makes it look matte. And it'll protect your paint uh, and your bike. So it comes with everything you need. It comes with a little X-Acto knife, a squeegee, and a little spray bottle in there with the film. It's like, what, 15, 20 bucks on Amazon. I'll leave a link in the description. And it should be pretty quick and pretty simple. So first step, probably gotta wipe down, clean the bike so you have a good surface to apply this to. Let's get started. Okay, so obviously before you wanna start, you're gonna have to take off all your accessories. I just have this, so I'm just gonna take this off real quick, just like that. There we go. Just like that. Okay, now we got a clean slate. I'm gonna go ahead and wipe it down first though. Mine's already pretty clean because I haven't been riding it a lot except for to the gym. Okay, so you can see the kit here it comes with a little exacto knife, your little squeegee, and then the spray bottle, which is empty. You're just gonna have to, it says fill it with uh, soft or gentle soap and the rest with water. A few drops of soap and the rest with water. So you're gonna spray this on the bike first and then squeegee out uh, the liquid from underneath this. So it should go on with no bubbles if you do it right. Shouldn't be too hard though. Okay, so I got my little water sprayer ready to, ready to spray. And so basically you just need to cut a piece that you want. So obviously, just like that, I'm gonna cut it a little long and try to trim around the curves. So I'll cut it like there. As you can see, this is very precise. Hopefully I don't cut my finger off. So you got your right, the right shape cut out. See, I got mine cut out. Not perfect, but you know, it's, it's gonna work. So you see it's gonna sit there and it's gonna go right like that. Just like that. So now spray your little soapy water down and then peel this off and apply it. Actually, I'm just gonna do it instead of telling you. Do this right here. Spray it all over. You ever like wrapped anything? You've probably done this, maybe. All right, you can see the little matte film. That's what we're gonna be putting on the bike. You wanna do like this. Make sure it doesn't fold. Put it right where we want it. Already it looks sick. Hopefully I'll be able to get everything out though. A little squeegee it comes with. So the soapy water helps like get bubbles and imperfections out. Might take a little bit for the water to dry or the soapy stuff to dry. I should probably get like a heat gun too. Might have to trim that. Okay, I just finished the top part. So far it looks really good actually, you can see it's matte instead of gloss. I'm really excited about this part and I really want it to look really good. So I'm gonna do a little template, cut it out and make sure it's as good as it can get. Cause this side, it doesn't go all the way down. You probably can't see it on camera, but you can see somewhere on the side it ends and it's glossed again. I'm using my GoPro, so it might not be the best picture. You might not be able to see this good, but. I'm gonna go ahead and do that part, and I'm excited about that. All right, so it's been a few minutes since I last picked up the camera. I'm on my different camera. I went to class, did a few things. So my plan originally for the bike was to wrap the whole top and the whole bottom with this the, the wrap, 
but I didn't have enough. So instead, I wrapped just this blue part with the matte wrap and the whole top. So I don't know how well it turned out on camera, but you can see the difference a little bit, hopefully, between the gloss and the matte. Maybe from this side, you can see it a little better. So you can see the top bar right there is matte finish. And then this piece here is the gloss, and then I added the matte finish on that part as well. I think it looks really good. I really like how it turned out. There's a, little, there's a few imperfections, but I think I could be able to look past that. This, I'm really happy with. Turned out really nice. It would have been nice to do the whole thing, but I just didn't have enough vinyl. Hopefully this gave some of you guys some ideas. I'll leave a link to that wrap down in the description. Uh, if you need, if you want to do your whole bike, I'd say probably get two of the, of the thing. It's only like 15 or 20 bucks, so um, for, for what you get, it's a pretty good deal. It's not extremely easy, but it's pretty easy to figure out. And as long as you're careful and precise, then it should turn out really good. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one, and peace.